Hey everybody, this is T-Vlog. I'm back again, you guys. And so, what I'm doing now is I'm getting ready to um, make a pumpkin pie. Yes, pumpkin pie. Fall season, pumpkin pie. So, I use my canned pumpkin here, great value, 100% of pumpkin pumpkin. I have my evaporated milk. I have my uh, beaten, two beaten eggs. I have in this pot, can you please? I have in this bowl my puree pumpkin. Right here is my half a tea teaspoon of salt. My one here is my one and a half, one and a half of sugar. And down here in the brown part, let me see if I can turn it around the opposite side so you can see. Okay. Okay, there we go. Right here is my pumpkin sp pie spice seasoning. And I got that from Walmart for 99 cents at Great Bay. So I'm putting a little twist on this, this recipe. Because I'm going to add just a little butter. And I'm going to add my lemon flavor. To my pumpkin spice, my pumpkin pie. So, right now, I'm getting ready to add my milk, and I have to add one cup and a half of evaporated milk. So, this is a cup, and half of that evaporated milk. And I add my beaten eggs. And all along in there, I'm going to go ahead and add my flavor. And this is a half a teaspoon, so I'm going to add a whole teaspoon of flavor. Lemon flavor, y'all. Or you can use fresh lemons. I was going to use fresh lemons, but I looked up and saw I had lemon flavor. So, And then I'm going to have, this is about maybe two, about a teaspoon uh, and a half of butter. So I add that, just to have a little richness, buttery taste to it. So, and I'm just going to, I have a blender, but I'm just going to do this by hand, guys. Just go ahead and incorporate all that goodness up in this bowl. <laughs> Ooh, it smells good. Smell like fall. Smell like Thanksgiving. <laughs> So I'm going to go ahead and mix this up. And after you mix this up and you put it into your pie crusts, you want to bake it for 40 to 50 minutes. And I'll be back to show you what those pies look like. It may be a second half of this video to show you what those pies look like. But this is the first half. And I'm just showing you how to this recipe. Alright, be back. Okay guys. I am back. So what I'm about to do now is pour this into my crusts. And I'm going to try to make it as even as possible. You guys, this smells so good. I know how to make the fresh pumpkin pies. My mom showed me. And I'm going to eventually do it one day. But I'm just not going to do it right now. <laughs> How you hold the pie, the uh, pumpkins out, and you take everything out, the seed and everything, <laughs> and you scrape the sides of the pumpkin out. And then what you do is you take it and you boil it until it's 
completely done where it's like mushy. And then you take like a cheesecloth or a real clean dry towel. And that's how you squeeze all the water out of the fresh pumpkin. <laughs> but you got to make sure all the strings, as many strings that you can. And kind of take it through like a little whisker thing, <laughs> whisker thing like this here. And uh, mine is all beaten up. And make sure you can get all the puree and stuff out. And then you add all your spices and flavoring and stuff like that. So, um, these pies are not done. But when they get done, you all will see the end and result. So, I just wanted to bring this video with the pumpkin pies that I'm making. Uh, if you like this video, that simple, easy recipe... Share, like, comment, subscribe, smash the notification bell, never fail to leave a comment, hit that notification bell, keep all on there, so that way, when you hit the bell, and it shows all, that means you will get all the videos that I have uploaded recently, and probably in the past, and you will be able to see them. So, thanks you guys, have a blessed Saturday, and enjoy your day. Take care, bye.